Hello everyone, Nary here from Drakewing Gamers, if you know me on Twitter, The Gaming Dragon. Today we're taking a look at another one of the PS1 haunted demo disc games called Dead Heat. And as you can see, we have a very lovely looking lady on the front and a somewhat dead looking lady behind her. <laughs> oh dear. Alright, so without further ado, let's see what this game is all about, shall we? Oh! Okay... Alright, let me set my little timer. I don't know how long this game is, so we'll see. Lilith, Sons of Argos, Case to Lilith. Okay, so. Argos. Detective level 3. Sunja is a talented liar and highly persuasive woman with a keen sight into the hearts of men. Her deductive skills are formidable, though physically unimposing. Okay. You've done your best to not let the black tentacles of corruption stain your perfect record, even at the cost of some friends. The underground resents you, but those who also remain untouchable will aid a fellow crusader. Dirty cow. You don't mind getting a little dirty and get to get what you need, and your reputation for blackmail and extreme measures precedes you. Honest folk will see you as trouble, while some in the underground understand you know the score. Black Widow. Manipulating and threatening people isn't a job, it's a lifestyle. Shaking into the, snaking into the minds of men and pressuring their most vulnerable side for your own ends is a challenge you derive endless pleasure from. Criminals and honest folk alike want nothing to do with you, but that won't stop them from fall... I don't know, from falling into your black coils. Oh dear. I'm gonna do, uh, clean cup. Okay. All right. Ooh, around 20 minutes ago, my boss, old soul, decided to give me one of his complimentary wake-up calls. Am I talking to a zombie? I barely had time to cover myself before getting a glimpse of his bloated, sweaty face peering through a CRT monitor. A monitor which had to be designed with no brightness control just to torture me. The overfed slave driver decided it wasn't quite time for me and Lily to go on vacation, proceeded to slap us with another jumper case. If you told me five years ago that I would be woken up at 11.15 to pick out a rotting corpse in a freezing alley in October, I would have stuck with dancing. <laughs> suppose I sh Suppose I should see how Lily is getting on. Tank controls! Wait. How are you feeling? Besides getting over the last week, the last weekend, pretty good. Don't worry about it. We'll be done with the stiff and back off the clock in no time. Yeah, I hope you're right. Also, I told you so. Told me what? I told you as soon as that walking fridge got here, he would take us for all we're worth. Well, what choice does he have? Almost everyone else is either dead or suspended. Ooh, that's not good. Well, it was a good idea on paper. It got us a job. And you can be snarky about it all you want. It did some good. Yeah, sure. Horseshoes and hand grenades, sweet meats. Well, there's a lot less of those floating around now, isn't there? Horseshoes, maybe. Sweet meat, not where I'm standing. Hand grenades, not a chance. Just because we haven't found them yet doesn't mean they're not there. NB might not have them, but someone does. And the best part, thanks to Fat Boy, we don't have the chance to find them. We're burning time. Come on, let's see what Bishop's found. Alright, wait. Get this over with. Alright. What is with the slow walk, girls? After a few years at this job, seems like this stopped bothering you. Most of the time, it's some poor sap who look, whose luck ran out on him. More often than not, with his wife. This guy looks like this guy looks the part. Let's see how bad his luck was. Made a new friend, Bishop. 
You know how I like my friends. Dead. Quiet. What else have you learned about him, other than he's not a talker? <laughs> 32 years old in human years, roughly 64 years old in zombie, huh? Blood readings show ZAB+, same as Lilith, as a matter of fact. Okay, so there are zombies in this game. <laughs> Except that there's no alcohol traces. Now, my fault you don't know how to have fun. What's the damage? Well, scans show the fall shattered most of his rib cage. Glass has dug itself deep into the organs and punctured his lungs in several different places. Must have been thrown out with some force. CSI poking around up there? They just left, photographed everything up there, but couldn't stick around to give you the normal walkthrough. Something called them downtown. They said that they will have a report on your desk, hopefully by the end of the night. We'll head up there then. You okay with uh, Mr. Bryant? I've got as much as I can get from scans. I'll take him downtown and get him on the slab. Come see me when you get back to the station. We'll go through the autopsy and see what we find. I love going to your happy place. I don't. <laughs> All right. All right, so I'm guessing I'm going over here. Yep. All right. What do we got? Hope you guys are staying safe, by the way. I know it's... Uh, remember, if you find anything physical, check it over once you have it. You never know what you might find. Can I talk to you? Let's keep looking. Okay. Hmm. What's that? Looks like one of those old matchbooks from Lilith's time. Keepsake from his old life, maybe? Oh. Okay. I like how detailed the scenes are. Oh god, I can just walk through the couch. There we go. Looks like they're packing up the stiff. Okay. Oh. The Immortal Murderer. Night of the Cannibals. Explosion Fighter 5. Double, extre double Extremism. Let's see, what do we got? The Forgotten Weapon. Fist of Victory. Hmm. Just some movies, it seems. It's over here. Let's head over to this. Why do I walk so slow? Oh, oh, wait a minute. Okay. Oh, alright. Counter. Okay. Huh. <laughs> what do we got? Boy, quite a voluptuous zombie, if I say so. Yeah, that's blood. Hmm. Foot looks like shoe prints right there in the blood. Oh, this reminds me of a game. This is probably modeled after that. God, I can't remember. It was a Dead Fear or something like that. It was this um, weird horror mystery game about two lesbians. Yeah, no, it sounds awesome, right? <laughs> They rebooted it recently, and it didn't do very well. Dead Fear? I forget the name of it, but yeah, this is this is modeled after that. Alright, what do we got? Power isn't working. Alright. Power isn't working. Okay. You say? I mean, uh, the computer's just unplugged, probably. What do we got? 
To Leon Bryant, I am writing this message to you to remind you of the severe penalties regarding the misplacement of security passes. These are in place to ensure your safety and the safety of everyone else at NYX Pharmaceuticals. The loss of your security pass has endangered you and your co-workers. As this is your first infraction, you will be issued this warning. Repeat infractions will see your pay reduced for the month. Further infractions will see your employment contract ended. You will be issued your replacement card in the next three weeks. We, we advise all employees to store their cards in secure and memorable locations around their homes. Mm, excuse me. Please ensure to take every possible measure to keep this replacement safe. There's a note scribbled on the back. Leave password with Matt at bar. He'll know what to. Sh he'll know who to show it to. Hmm. All right. So I got some information. So someone at a bar has a password. A safe. Well, isn't this interesting? Fuck, what's that password? Well, hell if I know. Let's see. Mirror, mirror on the wall. It's a mirror. Oh, I like how it has a reflection. That's cool. Oh, that's really cool. What do we got? What do we got? Who's the pup? I can't do anything with that. Alright. How do I run? Left control, okay. That is such a weird... Okay. Oh, now I know how to move faster. Alright. We'll see him back at the station. What do we got over here? Let's take a little look around and see if we can find anything. See anything over here? New, no, just some trash. The, there is no body, it's gone. What do we got? I guess we just go back to the station now. I like this game. I hate tank controls, because I think they are supremely awkward. I realize there are some people who will defend to death the use of tank controls, but I am not one of them. I respect their opinion. Can I, uh... Oh, what's this? What is this? Okay. All right, let's go. Uh, was that... Really? Was that it? Uh... Uh, that was a demo? Not much happened in that demo. I like the style they're going for. There's probably something I missed. I mean, there has to be something I missed, but... Hmm. Even then, that's still rather short. God. Alright, yeah, that wasn't... Wasn't even 20 minutes. Okay. Um, Alright, guys, that was uh, Dead Heat, a game in which not much actually happens so far uh, I had I have to have missed something something important but and if that's the case that is on me but I do like the style this game is going for it uh, very much reminds me of the old Resident Evil and detective games so that's pretty cool uh, hopefully I'll hear more about this and hopefully they will have they will have controls 
that can be used with a Xbox controller because this is the kind of game that would be fun to play on an on an on a controller of some sort. <laughs> I do not like tank controls on a mouse and keyboard. That shit is very irritating. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a little bit shorter than I anticipated, being only about eh, a little over 15 minutes. That's not bad. But uh, anyway, guys, please stay safe. Uh, God, hopefully it's only a little bit longer before we can go out back into the world again. I love you all. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Mm,